Good morning, welcome here, and welcome to the another project, of course. I mean, I did the right thing and went to the internet and saw that there is a cheapest Pajero out there uh, in the marketplace. And then, uh, of course, I was obliged to buy it, and now it's here. So, uh, here it is, 2001, oh, well, it's made in 2000, but registered first time in 2001. Pajero third generation, 3.5 GDI. Haven't done uh, so much miles or kilometers, it's around 230,000. And uh, it is with black leather interior, and it's the project car, but let's the pictures take or speak for uh, themselves. Come and take a look. mold a bit of a mold that's a bit understatement on the seat need to get rid of that one and the steering rack is already partly disassembled and he didn't never get to it to fix it back so we need to do we're gonna do that one and of course these the bolts for alignment, those will be rusted as well, those will need to be fixed. And one tire, and that's the spare tire. So when it comes to the rust, so this is the worst bit actually. I mean, it looks quite bad, but to be honest, I mean, yes, of course, there are some bubbles here. I mean, that's probably rough through, but the worst part in the car is actually here, it's nowhere else, it's the this, and this corner also, but nowhere else is the rusted through another side of the wheel arch is good as well. So we need to cut it this one away and then need to fabricate some new metal in. So when it comes to the interior as well, yes, it's moldy. Lots of bits are on the ground. Need to put the sun visors back because he was fixing the holes in the roof. And yes, of course, we have like some of the Wi Fi switches. Didn't know that that here it existed. Wi Fi rear differential look. Haha, uh -huh. funny. But saying that actually, you see, it's actually this car is equipped with electrical heater windscreen, you have a climate control in the front and in the rear. And this is the funny bit. Rear, rear differential lock. That's to be yet and driving in a off road. And this one, I need to figure out actually from which phone it is. I can find one and then maybe already know, guys, maybe you can comment which phone it was Nokia or Ericsson. But that's quite cool actually. Some message from the 2000s. Yes, and I saw he has been disassembled the uh, middle console as well, so I need to have a... those to put out, put back uh, gear knobs and as well the, the panel here. So as you saw, it is in a bit of a state, right? But uh, nothing we can fix for an old girl. And the uh, hardest part, of course, will be rust, but of course it's moldy, it doesn't have the front... it has a front bumper, but has been taken off. 
and be taken off because the steering rack was leaking. So that we need to fix first. Or no, there is other thing that I need to fix first and that's the mold that you saw. So I need to get rid of that one. There's some interior bits and uh, uh, missing. So yes, there's quite a lot to do, but quite excited. I really like those big and bulky SUVs. Um, particularly this one is also very capable on off-road. So let's try to get the old lady back on the road in all its former glory and it's not going to be easy road, but if you want to see it, just bear with me.